All right, guys, it's your boy Extreme Catfishing here. We are at uh, Canal Recreational Area in, um, I think this is Bonet. It might be Slash Monk's Corner also. Um, but we're doing the uh, um, PCF hike here today of Lake Moultrie from Canal all the way to Bonet Beach, which is uh, Richardson's Landing. We're going to hike all the way down there to the beach area and have lunch. And then we're going to commute back here and go on to work tomorrow. Yuck. Okay, so <laughs> what I like to do first is kind of introduce everybody. Everybody, just give me your first name and where you're coming from. Laura from Sumter. Alan from Lexington. Hello again, Ann from Columbia. Hello, Ann. Betty from Lexington. Darlene from Lexington. Renee from Lexington. Rosemary from Chapin. How'd you sneak in? It's Chris from Latin. <laughs> Angela from Latson. Ruth from Charleston. And what's your name? This is Freddie. Hello, Freddie. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so y'all met the crew, so we're going to go ahead and start the hike here. It should take us about two and a half hours to get to the other end. Um, but it should warm up earlier today. It's going to be a little chilly across, going across the dike with the water out there. But we got a bunch of troopers here. We sure will be no problem dealing with that, 42 right? 42 degrees right now. 42 degrees right now, that's right. Okay guys, so we'll see y'all in a bit. She works in catfish. Later. I'll see y'all in a bit. Bye. Should be straight across to the left. Yeah. Yep, this way. You gotta do is follow the markers here. The hikes that I lead, I've already finished, so I never lead a hike that I've never done. I always have knowledge about it, so. <sighs> I never want to take somebody on a hike and be like, uh, I think we go this way. <laughs> that would be bad. <laughs> Now I've been told that there people have seen alligators out here, oh, cool. but I have yet to see an alligator on the Lake Moultrie Passage. Oh, okay. I did all 24 and I, I couldn't find any of them. Not even turtles. Yeah, must be. <laughs> Going to the restroom? Hey guys, let's hold up for a second so we don't want to leave one person back here. Hold up for a second. We got a bathroom break back here. I don't want to leave anybody. Oh, okay. <laughs> 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 
No, I'm not supposed to be filming that. <laughs> That's a different type of movie. <laughs> This is the most steep this trail gets. That's it. You don't get no steeper than this. <laughs> <sighs> so we're out of the wooded section and we're getting ready to uh, take this road up here up to the left onto the dike and on the dike for about two and a half miles so it dumps us out into Bonet Beach while we head down to the beach area. One of the things that I kept when I was out here, I was walking and you'll see cranes that'll be in these rocks. Mm -hmm. So I'm walking the dike and I'm going real slow so I can get a picture of him. He's like 20 feet away from me. He's standing there, he'll look back at me like this. He'll look back at me like this. He'll wait till I get right. close enough, almost close enough for a picture. He'll fly off 50 feet down the way and sit down on the rocks again. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's right. And if you'll notice, when we start walking this way, if you look to the right, you'll see some of the rocks have the mileage marked on them. Oh. So as we go along, yeah, well not these, these are, these are some markers for Santee Cooper. Oh. They'll actually be spray painted on the rocks. Oh, okay. Yeah. The mileage of the lake? The mileage of the path. Yeah. yeah. Come Correct. Oh. Correct. So where was mile one? Mile one was where we started. Okay. Of this passage, yeah. Okay. That's where we started. Oh, it doesn't start at one end of the state and then the state. Well, it does, but this passage starts back there. Numbering. Numbering. So how close was it to this weather like? In Bay it was Don't feel rushed guys, if y'all want to stop and take photographs or whatever, help yourself. Hey Chris? Yeah, oh. Oh no. <laughs> Dude, come on. <laughs> the generating station, son. Generating station. <laughs> The ducks out here seem to be the most friendly. They're the ones that let you get close enough to take a decent picture before they start swimming away. And that's funny because the last time I was here, all that was dry. And now it's a mud bath out there. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, that rain we had. Yeah. Thirsty. Yep. Up in the trees for an hour. Yeah. <laughs> so if I fall over, don't worry. But I'm all the time keeping an eye out. Long just think I'm all right. You and me both. If I have all been warned, if I see a snake, I just don't get in my way. <laughs> exactly. Uh, now that happened the exact same time before. I got right right here and that train came down the track. Yeah, so we just missed it. It's about what, 1130? Yep. Yeah, that's 1130. Yeah. I'm going to go 1130 on Sundays. Next time I start to hike at about 1125. <laughs> so we can all see the train. It was, well, it was, yeah, he was just kind of feeding alongside the rocks, really? huge, wow. I mean, he must have been yeah, good long size, yeah. baby. No, I didn't get a picture, they got him, my, my, I don't take very good pictures from distance. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it was cool. There he is. You got it too. Whoa! Yeah. Can I you see it? Yeah. Wow. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That picture didn't turn out very good. Yeah. Yeah. My goodness. Yeah. That's a big. <laughs> yeah, he got, he got him too. Oh, he probably got better pictures. Yeah. Yeah, he got well, he got yeah. yeah. He didn't seem like he was scared either. We probably could have jumped in the water. He'd have stayed where he was, just yeah. swimming along. We could have had dinner. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> That's a beautiful view, isn't it? Sure is. I guess it's too cold for boats. There must be a lot of boats normally, right? Normally, yeah, there'd be a lot out here. But I guess most boaters don't want to brave that ice cold water on that boat. You get a little sprinkle on you and you freeze. That's right. <laughs> now, I have thought, I've thought about going down here and going down to the water. But my problem is, is getting back, back up. Because no. see, I had a backpack. Right. And my thing is, can I get back up here with that backpack on? Right. So, and then if you get down there, turn your ankle, you're screwed. So. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Especially if you're by yourself. That's right. I saw, I don't see any today, but when I did this section before, there were a couple of fishermen that actually were down there at the uh, rock's oh. edges fishing out there in Lake Moultrie, so. Well, we saw that boat while ago that came up, turned around up here and went back. Yep. I've gone on the rock yep. like this before, too. And right now, I guess you wouldn't have to worry about it with uh -huh. snakes. Yep. I saw snakes all over. Yep. Did y'all see the markings on the rocks as y'all were coming yes. along? Yes. Okay. We got, we got, she didn't see it. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to show her. <clears throat> I think they're marked every two, every half a mile. So. Yeah, the last one we figured was half miles. So. Yep. What the two and a half a minute said two. Two, exactly. Mm -hmm. well, one. Now y'all guys see that shed? Y'all see that shed up there ahead of us? Yes. And that's the one that I was thinking about oh, that shade. we take a break up. There's a shed straight ahead. Oh, okay. We're gonna take a break up there, and then we'll uh, get back on if y'all guys want. Did y'all guys run out of gas? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> you were conserving gas. Yes, that's <laughs> it. <laughs> so we've been 1.3 miles since we started the berm here. Okay. 1.3 miles since we started on the berm here. You have one of them clickers? Cool. Yeah. And that thing count your steps? I don't know. Huh. I, I walk and run, so it just um, measures and times me and then gives me my pace. Cool. I might do that other stuff. Yeah. I don't count We've that. done at least two miles from the beginning because I've already marked about 2.6 miles. Yeah, I forgot to start it at the, at the at parking, parking area. Lot. I, yeah. When we got up here, I remembered.
but I figured we only went about half a mile from then, so we got about a little more than that. Yeah. Y'all see those ponds over there to the right? Those are DNR's ponds over there, I believe. Those are wetlands, aren't they? Yeah, but there's there's a couple of ponds over here that they're keeping. Yeah, and I, there's the shed up here. I think is a feed either a, a into the lake or back to the ponds point for it, because you'll see the pipes when we get up here. It's the only thing I can think of that they could be. There's no reason for those pipes to be there, but they're along the uh, all the way along the dike on the whole passage. With the pipes or the ponds? The those pipes. Because I built the dike? Ma'am? Were those created because I built the dike? I believe so, yes. A lot of dirt. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this was a dry <laughs> yeah. rock. Yeah. Because a crane or something large. Yeah. A large bird. Hey, I keep forgetting binoculars. <laughs> One day, I'm going to remember them and there'll be nothing to see. That's right. <laughs> what? Your phone doesn't have an app for binoculars? <laughs> <laughs> There's not an app for that yet. <laughs> you're alright, you're alright. <sighs> so what you think about the hike so far, Chris? Hey, what you think about the hike so far? Good? Oh, you have, oh, what about yours? You want to use that one? Yeah, this is, I'm using it on the all he had, he was, a, he was a bargain $80 dog at the pound, and then when I got him home, uh -huh. I had this... How are you doing? Are you having fun? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're so precious. You remind me of my puppy. You remind me of my puppy. Yes. She can figure out what we... First we put her in a pen. If you just press it down just a little bit, it'll focus. Would you hold this for me, please? Yes, ma'am. I want to talk to you. Can I get you grabbing the leash? You don't run yours on some of the holes. All right, come on. I'm going to get all five of them. i got to back up. Don't back up too far. Yeah. Okay. Oh, this is good. One, two, three. See the little duckies right there? I, uh, How do you know that rhyme? From children or something? Uh, Come back up this one, Charlie, okay? Okay, where did they, they can stand her for a long time. Yeah, they can. I was at, um... I'm going to go all the way down. Yeah. Just reached the uh, Richardson's Landing. I'm ready to head to the beach part. We are approaching the beach. I think that's a private pier out there. Yeah, being around a public, 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 public,
And here's the beach. And the water is up. Oh, wow. Yeah, the last time I was here, the last time I was here, that water was way past that pier. That's where it started? Yeah, way past that pier. We don't have much of a beach, but we have one. That rain we had yesterday is what brought it up. <laughs> Anywhere here? So how'd y'all like the hike? We like it. Yeah, it's a great yeah. hike. Beautiful day for it, I tell you. We got a new dog. Got a friend. Mm -hmm. I was telling everybody that this the water is actually up. It was actually way when I came out here and did this, it was actually way past that pier, at least 20 feet past that pier before. So the rain that we had yesterday must have really put it up here. Well, oh, guys, this is the end of the hike here. All the way from Canal Wreck area down here to Bonnet Beach, and this is Bonnet Beach. Or well, Bonnet. It's a French singing name. I'm not really good at French. <clears throat> but as you can see, the water's up pretty far. If you remember watching my last, uh, I think it was either part one or part two of um, the Lake Moultrie Passage, um, I braked at the beach, and it was actually way back here past this dock. Actually, the water line was actually back there where the uh, uh, the wall is right there. So the water has come up a lot since the last time I've done this, and that was maybe two months ago. So water was pretty low apparently when I was out there. I just want to say thank you to everybody that signed up for the hike. Um, I really enjoy leading you guys. You're all fun, and I'm glad everybody had a good time. I hope to see everybody on the next hike, and multiple hikes after that. Because more than likely, your boy Extreme Catfishing is going to be leading them. It's your boy Extreme, man, and I'm out. Clothes in a bag for you. <laughs> <laughs>